Kirby, the rally heads west into the dusty Aberdare Mountains. Ari Vatanen leads the way in his Subaru, the Finn on his first championship rally since his near-fatal accident in Argentina, and fresh from his victory in the Paris-Dakar raid. Unlike most world championship events, competitive sections of the rally are run on open roads. The possibility of oncoming traffic is always an ever-present danger. Second on the road, Walter Rall in the second Audi, closely pursued by Bjorn Valdegaard. The Swede, looking for another safari win, is backed up by Lars Erik Toff. Erwin Weber, Ericsson's teammate in the light and nimble VW Golf GTI, hits trouble early on when his gearbox fails, costing him more than an hour. But for Blomqvist, his trouble started before the rally began. His car, involved in a road accident, was written off. Now driving his teammate's car, he took an early lead, but was destined to leave the rally with electrical problems. And recovering from a broken drive shaft, Kenneth Erickson, the young Swede, as expected, proving a constant threat. Also trying front-wheel drive this year is Opel, with their cadet GSI and safari veteran Rano Altena. Rudy Stahl entered his semi-private Audi Coupe Quattro. And Robin Olliet completes the Toyota entry. Shekhar Mehta shows off the Nissan in its first major appearance, with teammates Kirkland and Zanussi right behind. Eklund, another veteran, has been drafted into the Subaru squad with his English co-driver, Dave Whittock. The expected rains have not come. River crossings have become dry, allowing the pace of the early leaders to ease them clear of the pack. Mikola, second behind Valdegard, the Swede, takes advantage of the clear conditions as his rivals choke in the dust. Mikula powers the big Audi over the rugged terrain. In contrast, Walter Rall, now with Ericsson in his mirrors, is content to slow down. The lunar-like landscape holding the potential of time-consuming punctures. Right behind him appears the hard-charging Ericsson, determined to match the pace of Valdegard and Mikula. <laughs> 